so last episode we had a lot of bombs dropping up on us you know basically info drops the fact that the old lady that is supposed to be um, Weevil's mom is like the original Buckingham Stussy dude like these past few episodes are like being revealed and you know what I'm all I'm all for it and I don't want to prolong this intro because dude Gorosei one of the Gorosei is about to land or to go to Egghead Island. And this is Eleven Hundred and Six. The Kumas that are guarding the Egghead Island. Is it? Or is it the separate thing? Oh shit. Yeah, I was right. It's the Kumas that are protecting the island. Damn! Okay! Lighting, the basically the overall cinematography in this episode is kind of crazy. I think we're about to get a really good episode here. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty stupid of you, sir. No, is that uh Niko Niko no Mi? Oh no. What is that? Exactly. Bubble shield? Oh, fudge! Wow. Ooh. Whoa! This was the droid that was. Chasing Luffy and the others earlier. Damn. I mean, of course, Vegapunk keeps the you know greatest cyborgs. At least the cyborgs have mercy. Sentomaru, then. At least he's fine, right? Hmm. Wait. So my question is, the people who are working in Egghead Island, are they real people? Or, or are they like cyborgs as well? Or like clones? I don't know. I'm just... I'm thinking out loud. You can answer them, but please make sure that's not spoilers. Or those are not spoilers. Mm. I mean, believe in Luffy. I have no choice to. Damn! It's a lot of Mark Threes! Woo! 
たちの生みの親を必ずこの島から脱出させるんだ Yeah, and where did he disappear to, Vegapunk? My heart. We're, we're about to. Yeah, we're about to see the backstory. I don't think I'm ready for this, wait. The voice actor. Yeah, apparently I saw in news who will be voice acting Kuma's Kuma as a child, so Wow, okay, the transition. Wow, the voice acting, let's go. Exactly, that's my go oh, that was my question. Atlas. I don't like this one. I love you, Robin. 
それでステラに会いたいのだけど何が起きたの起きている異常事態は2つある落ち着いて聞いてくれ1つはステラの失踪もう1つはフロンティアドームの制御が不能になったラボフェーズから出られなくなったということだ出ようとすればレーザーに焼き殺されると覚悟してくれ待て待て俺たちはベガパンクを連れて海に出るんだろそうだが連れ出すべき当人が消えてしまったどうすんだよまずできることはステラを見つけることだ私たちも探しに行きましょう早く見つけて出航しなきゃね未来のお宝にも興味あるしあ面白そうですねお供します待て待て待てお前ら今あかんこと考えてるやろ私も探してくるわステラがいなくなるなんて心配わしも同行しようあらありがとうスティアセイザマンおでも連れてってくれこれも、no, sir. 待てマリモなんだよ<笑>頭の切れたジジを見つけりゃいいんだろう、no. そう探すだとそのお前を誰が探すんだよ<笑>そんなこと確かにだ<笑>メモだよお願いおとなしくしてて仕方ねえな待ってろベガパンク<笑>ベガパンクバカでよやれやれあいつら何を言ってんだかな人探しくらいあいつらで十分か、えー、お前どんだけ全力で走ってんだええー、俺はいつでも、えー、<笑>それにしてもまさかこいつらとまた会うとはな懐かしいなウォーターセブンあいつのおっさん元気かな、oh. Are we like seriously looking into them? Oh shit, Morgans. This guy, that's not even. Who's that? Vivi! Nani Kaitagana? Kitaba? Dama to Kitara. Take t o n a k o Is it me or Vivi's voice actress changed? Yeah, that's definitely a different. <laughs> How can she not? His, her father died. Huh? Soundtrack. What the heck? How the how did they end up with Morgans? What the fudge? You ended like that. Oh my goodness. Okay, so another bomb drop, I guess. But okay, uh. We're about to. I thought we were about to see、um, Kuma's backstory, but I guess it's like a glimpse that we will be seeing the backstory through Bonnie's eyes. Again, Stella is nowhere to be found. Yeah, at the start of the episode, we get to see Santomaru take charge of the pacifistas. Basically, probably the strongest pacifistas that Vegapunk. Created, and of course, they had to be the ones guarding Egghead Island. I mean, I have no beef with that, but of course, the world government I don't know, I think the go world government aren't really like aware of that. But yo, I wanna know also why Sintomaru is so close with Vegapunk. Probably a backstory of that too. And yeah, a lot, a lot is happening.
a lot is happening. And now our lovable Vivi is with Morgans and with Wobble. How the frick that happened? How the frick did that happen? Like they were was Morgans and Marijoa at the same time as the Reverie? Yo, um, I, I don't I don't remember anymore, but okay. I mean, as long as Vivi is safe, and I hate the fact that Morgans is I don't know. I mean, how could she not cry? I mean, her dad just like died. I mean, I don't know, man. The questions added to our plate again, and I hope we get those answers soon enough. And hopefully, 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 I I know that probably Kuma's backstory is gonna destroy me, but I want to know already. And the fact that um, Bakugo Bakugo's voice actor is voicing Young Kuma, dude. The level of him crying as Kid Kuma is, I don't know, it was making me tear up already. And I'm excited. I'm excited to know what the backstory of Kuma is with you guys. But yeah, that's it. That's it for your reaction. That's basically a build up again on what's to come. If you'd like to see our reactions to other shows or other animes, please head on over to our Patreon and the link is down below in the description box. If you liked the video, please give us a thumbs up, drop a comment, let us let me know what you think about this episode. Did I miss something? Are they honor or are there any other things that I'm supposed to know? But please no spoilers. Please, please, please. No spoilers. And yeah, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. It will definitely help us out and it will definitely help the channel out. And don't forget to click on the notification bell to not miss out on any of our videos. And there you have it. Gosh, one piece. One piece. We will be waiting for more. But yeah, I will see you on our next video or reaction. Bye.